we decide to remove a patient from activity when it's determined they have a concussion. If they have an acute concussion and concussion symptoms, uh, the decision is made to remove them from activities until further clearance. Uh, further clearance is multifactorial. There's the clinical evaluation, uh, physical exam. Um, in addition to that, there are supplemental tools, and that's what the impact quick test brings to the table. It's a supplemental concussion assessment tool um, that we use as an adjunct to our clinical evaluation. There are a great deal of valuable features to the impact quick test. Uh, in my setting as a sports medicine physician practicing in an urgent care, perhaps the greatest feature uh, is the the quickness at which we can utilize the test. Um, the test is generally uh, going to take place in five to ten minutes. Um, that includes introducing it to the patient and completing the test. In addition, the familiarity of use of using an iPad is also a great valuable feature. Um, there's very little um, need for a patient to get comfortable to take the test. And so having impact quick tests as an option really allows us to seamlessly integrate a concussion management um, tool and a computerized neurocognitive assessment tool um, relatively easily um, as opposed to some of the other options that may take up 15-20 minutes of time which really isn't an option in an urgent care setting. Um, again with the high volumes and the rapid pace um, and the limited staff um, impact quick test really allows us to perform a test in five to ten minutes which is rather painless um, as it comes to the urgent care setting.